Hello everyone and welcome back to The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. In the last session, we headed to a random island, which takes away all your stuff when you arrive and then tells you to fight a big boss that one-shots you. So that went about as well as you'd expect. So today, we're going to continue on doing what the original plan was last time before I foolishly decided to try and explore something that wasn't a shrine. <laughs> And uh, we will try and find more shrines. That is that is my goal. My goal is to just do as many shrines as possible to get hearts so that I can actually survive some of this stuff. That is the plan. So let us head. Uh, I don't know. What's over here that I've already marked? That's, that's the Divine Beast. Uh, this is the tower. I can remove this pin because... Uh, well, actually, no, I couldn't get up there because of the rain, right? But the rain will probably stop once I defeat the Divine Beast. So we can get to that later. Uh, I put a pin there. I guess there's a shrine there that I just didn't do. Should we go to this tower and head over here and do this shrine? How about that? How about that for an opening, opening gambit in this session? As we hope and pray that things go better this time. As, as we always hope and pray. I feel like the last few sessions I've started off really positive and then something happens that just makes me sad. And then I'm like, okay, well, I'll take a few days break. Okay, next time, right, really positive. Oh, you're, you're taking away all my gear? Oh. You're telling me to fight a big boss? Oh, now I'm really sad again. <laughs> so once again, it's been a few days. I'm now feeling positive and hopeful. Is it that? I'm gonna assume it's that. Yes, it's that. Yeah. Okay. Huh. So yes. Positive vibes. Good energy. Today is going to go better. Unless this first shrine is another test of strength. And then I will just end the part <laughs> immediately. No, I won't. But I will be very upset. Nice little settlement these guys have got going on over here. Okay, we can grab this, then we can go over to that tower over there maybe. Open up some more of the map. Whoop! Sup, bruh. I've seen this guy before, haven't I? Hey there, I'm Bolden, Goron City's ambassador of tourism. Goron City is hot, but that's just the way we like it. It's not a dry heat, though. It's more of a burn-you-to-a-crisp heat. Be sure to pack some fireproof lizards if you're planning a trip. Okay. So, some desert place I assume that's talking about. It's going to be very hot. Damn, is there a shrine near here? My thing's beeping. I wonder if it's trying to tell me something. Bloop, bloop. Bloop, bloop. Bloop, bloop. Bloop, bloop. Rude. Hang on. <laughs> Wait, turn around. I sprinted before getting in the water and wasted a bunch of stamina. I can make this, right? Yeah, yeah. We're fine, we're fine. Hello. What weapon have I got? Soldier's Claymore? Sure. <laughs> Spirit. 
Spiked Boko Bow. An upgraded Boko Bow bound with animal bone to boost its durability and firepower. Its craftsmanship is sloppy, but it's light and easy to use. Um. Damn, he took a chunk of health, huh? Have I got anything that's worth, like... Let's eat the dubious food. And sure. Oh wait, this is surrounded by thorns. Is that why you exist? Is it the same as the previous one? One of the one of the first shrines we found, I think. Oh shit. Don't do it. Oh come on. Fuck, that's so irritating. Like, millimeters away from the shore. Okay, what if I don't dash? Let's let's see. Where do I actually make it any further if I don't dash? Yes. Looks like I do. Oh my god, that is in fact wow, dashing is fucking insanely bad. Like for stamina management purposes. That's crazy. That presumably applies to climbing as well then. Wow. I was like, I th thought it would probably, I thought that would probably be the trade-off, but I didn't realise it would be that enormous of a trade-off. That's crazy. That is actually crazy. Bloop, bloop. Bloop, bloop. Bloop, bloop. Oh, hello. What have you got for me? Ice arrow times five. I'll take it. Wait, shit. I'm too low. Fuck. Um. <laughs> Can't just, like, hack my way through it, can I? No. You'd think that you'd just be able to, you know, cut a path through with a fucking sword, but... Shit doesn't interact like that in this game, I guess. Hmm. Okay. Well. Guess there's another roadblock we've walked into. Um. Okay, let's try and get to that tower then. is that? <laughs> That's actually pretty far, huh? Well, whatever. Let's see if we can make it without getting fucking running into some boss that one-shots me. That'd be nice. Up. 
Hey man, what's that? You dying for some shield surfing action? That's it? Shield what now? <laughs> Chill out, my man. You don't need to worry about the details. My best bud is standing over there beneath that tree. He can show you the ropes. So you gonna go up there or not, my man? Totally. Mm. Epic. That's the spirit. After all, shields were made to be surfed on. Uh, I feel like they were made to block shit, but uh, sure. Hey man, nice of you to stop by. Sorry about Finn strong arming you into coming up here. <laughs> it's cause we're members of the shield surfing gang. The shield breakers. Finn and me are the only two members though. You just gotta live the experience, the lifestyle if you will. Yeah, shields were made to be surfed on. Oh, and uh, if you don't have your own shield, we've got some lying around here you can buy if you wanna. If people don't start buying them soon, this gang will go out of business. Shield surf. Hop on your shield and slide down hills. Guard, jump, ride. Guard, jump, right, there we go. Shield surf, jump while holding your shield, then press A while in the air. It's so weird that the tutorial comes up after you already do it. So you no longer need a tutorial at that point. <laughs> like, it already has the tutorial from the dude telling you, so... Right, but it fucks them up by riding on it, so you don't want to do that. <laughs> Sure, I guess. <laughs> I feel like that was just as slow as if I just sprinted it. Shrine nearby? Oh, good. Maybe I can get to this one, perhaps? For once? Aha! Are you surrounded by shit? No, I can actually get to you, I think. I just have to swim across here, which I think I can do. Fuck off. I'm going to this one because it looks closer. Can I eat while I'm swimming? I assume I can because eating's done in the inventory. Shaz Shrine. Skip the first cutscene. Skip the second cutscene. Wait. Keep waiting. Continue to wait. Skip the third cutscene. Oh my god, it's not a fucking test of strength. Have I hit the fucking lottery today? Should I play some numbers? Tempered power. Okay, got a lift. Anything hidden in the wall behind me? No, okay. Right, what's the gimmick here? Why is there a chest just like right here? Okay, there is no gimmick. <laughs> what, 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 okay, I'll take it. Or I guess I won't, because my inventory's full. Uh, is there anything I want to get rid of? 
Wait, how much? What was it again? It was a 12. I mean, it's probably better than the spiked club because I've probably used the spiked club a bit. Oh, wait, no, I haven't actually. It's glimmering, which means it's not been used. So it's just identical. But this is wood, which means I don't get hit in lightning, so I'll keep that. Um, right, what are you? And what am I actually interacting with over there? And where does this ball go? Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Do these have any connection? No. Okay. <laughs> What just changed when I did that? Something just changed, right? Did I just say it was badly damaged after one hit? I thought if it was shining... Oh, it just resets. Hmm. Oh wait, there's a path up here. Oh wait, no, that just is what drops the ball. Can I, if I go back up, can I like, is there an edge there? Like, can I jump over the, over the grating? I don't think I can, right? I'm just wondering like, obviously there's something over there that I need to interact with somehow. Oh, I need to get the ball. It's like a goal. Oh, that is the, that is the, yeah, okay. I need to get the ball over there. So I just stasis it and whack it real good. And then, right, okay, I get it, I get it. I get it. It's just a directional thing. You just have to hit it in the goal. You hit that to get a new one. Okay. Now let's see how hard it is to fucking line this up correctly. I feel like probably quite hard. Yeah, like that's... Oh god. Wait, that went fuck all... That didn't even... What? I hit that like five times, but it didn't even reach the thing. How many times do you have to hit it? Oh, shit. <laughs> yes! Yes! Okay. Got it. Hello. That was just phase one. Also, my thing broke, so now I can get this. Nice. That's why this chest was so obvious, because you have to keep whacking the ball, and so, obviously, your weapon can break. And they want to give you one in case you fuck it up a whole bunch. That's good. Right, so I need to... Okay, and this is on a rail, so I'm going to have to stasis it and knock it up the rail, but this is in the way. Oh, right, I knock it over. Okay, I see, I see. This one should be easier, shouldn't it? Because it stays on the rail, I'm not having to aim it. Yeah. That's that's just straight up easier. Because <laughs> it's just the same as last time, but without the additional challenge of aiming. Okay. What's back here? Wait. Huh? The goal is right there, but there's extra? There's a whole extra room back here? Oh. Oh. Okay, now this is where the additional challenge is. Okay. Hello. Okay. This is going to be hard. 
I see. This is actually, this is in fact so hard. Why is that? Oh, is it? All oh, right, okay. This is in fact so hard that they made it optional because it would be too hard for a lot of people to do. Oh boy. Oh boy. Too far to the right, and also way too few hits. Yes! That's it! That's the perfect angle! Keep fucking hitting it, boy! Oh. It was the perfect angle, but it was actually too strong. Well, that's unfortunate. Like there. Three, four. Okay, let's leave it at four and see how it goes with four. Okay, four is way too few, okay. Just got to get... I'm um, too far to the left on that, I think. I think that's good. Okay. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, let's try five. Because I think six was too many, wasn't it? So five is the sweet spot? No, okay. Five doesn't reach. So it has to be six. It has to be six, but seven would definitely overshoot. Seven must have been what I did the first time. One, two, three. Shit, this is going too far to the right. Four, five, six, seven. Wait. Wait, did I just do what I said not to do? Was seven. <laughs> yeah, I said seven was too many, and then I did seven. What am I doing? Okay, yeah, it's six. It's six. For some reason in my head... Wait, and it wasn't too far to the right, huh? For some reason in my head, I got... Even though I literally just said it, I then immediately got confused. One, two, three, four, five, six. There we go. What? Do you have to hole in one it? Is that the deal here? You have to hold him one it? Because that's some... That, like... Whew. That'd be seriously needing accuracy. Oh. Next thought, what if I move it? Oh, you motherfucker! That looked like it was a hole in one. Okay, that's how you do it. That's how you do it. That's how you do it. I was just fucking... I mean, it makes you think you should keep it here just by the way it's like raised up and shit, but you shouldn't. You gotta, you gotta get it right down the middle and you gotta get a hole in one. And it looked like I fucking had it, but I didn't. 
Something like that. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, come on! Come on! Come on! It's so close! Come on! Watch me actually run out of shit. Do these- I wonder if these chests respawn if you leave and come back in. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yes! Oh, yes! Fuck yeah. Giant ancient core. Okay, we found one of these before, and they're very rare. Extremely rare find, but we haven't found the researcher who would know how to use it because it's not either of the two people at the lab But if it's a reward for that, it must do something good Cool. This is what I'm fucking wanting. Oh, you bitch. That's not what I'm wanting. This is what I'm fucking talking about. That was sick. Very much enjoyed that If I could just play each of the shrines like back to back that would be like the dream for me in this game <laughs> Like, the non-combat, obviously, shrines. I really like the puzzle shrines. That was super fun. Gibby. How many do I have? I've forgotten. Blom. Bom, 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 bom. Oh, it's heart time. It is heart time. We love to see it. Blip, 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 bloop. I wonder if uh, we've got nine Korok seeds. We've got four spirit orbs. We found 16 shrines. We've got nine seeds. Uh, right, so I can fast travel back here if needs be. Uh, which, wasn't I headed towards a tower in this direction or something? I think so. Is that a horsey, horsey joint? Possibly. Um, let us jump back to here. So that we can level. Uh, and I guess we should see about getting more inventory space because we have nine seeds. Yeah, we've got four orbs, 16 shrines, nine seeds, and 500 thingamajiggers on us. Very, very nice. Huh. <laughs> Oops, man, I almost had it perfect, and then I walked into the water. Cheers, love! Blop. Right, now, uh... He was like, here? Right, I think? The dude? Uh, so how did I get... I guess I go up. Wait, I'm facing... Yeah. Yeah, okay, I go up here and then... Out that path, okay. Wait, you've got a quest now? You didn't have a quest before. Oh, it's you. Great timing. I have some news. I did more research regarding the Great Fairy Fountain, and I have a lead. However, although I know of the spot where it's likely located, it's really hard to get there. I'm not sure I can do it. 
Even if it's just a picture, I'm dying to see it. I'll help you out. I knew it. I just knew there was someone who, like me nearby who appreciates true beauty. Sadly, I can't pin down the exact location of the fairy fountain. I haven't put it all together yet. But there's a suspicious place I have my eye on. In fact, I was about to head there now. Would you like to come along? Sure. Great answer. Just what I expected from a fellow beauty connoisseur like you. Follow me. Find the fairy fountain. Alright. Let's give it a good old try. <laughs> 